that we that we um, that the Most High had back before Yahweh Shai came on the scene, now it belongs unto His Son. Now, yeah. now He has the uh, uh, the, the right to, to execute judgment. Now He's the judge. All right. Now He can do the um, uh, uh, when we pray. Back then, we had to pray straight to Yahweh. Right. Now we gotta pray to Yahweh Shai, man. Yeah. Okay. The sacrifice to, uh, to, to make those to, to honor those prayers, right? To huh. That's right. Back then we did what? We did the, the sacrifice. Yeah. Alright. Now that that sacrifice is, is null and void now. Yeah. Because Yahweh Shai already he got that out the way. He became that sacrifice. Okay. So he's doing it the same exact thing in authority that his father had. So he's so the Mosai has made his son equal with him. All right. The father himself he wanted to make his son his, his son equal with him, man. Yeah. But are they equal as far as the order? No. no. The father is still over him. Even though he gave him the duties of what he was did, how he passed the company on to his son, he's still the head of the company. Yeah. Even though his son has all the responsibilities of the head of the company. That's right, man. Verse 23, it says, that all men should honor the son. I'm going to read that again. That all men should honor the son even as they honor the father. I don't know, know how many times, I don't, mean, I don't know how many times this got to come, come out, man. Right. They, they, you know, they, they can't see it, man. The okay. church has preached that, bro. I mean, that's that's a basic scripture. The, the, the regular churches preach that, right? Hey, because to they, honor, they try to put it into the Trinity. That's yeah. how they teach it. But they, they yeah. <laughs> hey, because when it says to honor the Son, as, even as you honor the Father, it means that uh, uh, value Him the the same way you value Yahweh, man. Even that's though right. they're separate, even you know? though they're two different things. Matter of fact. It's already been coming out. Brothers already been bringing it out. But for edification here at camp, let's, let's, let's go into that word honor, man. Let's look it up. Okay. Go into the word honor. It's from the Greek word, tameo. And what does it mean? To estimate, fix the value for the value of something belonging to oneself. To honor, to have an honor, to revere, Ooh. venerate. Okay. That's what that means, man. All right. <laughs> Come on, man. All right. And the word worship, like when you look it up in a... Um, Etymology online, eat them online. What uh, it, it says to, to be found a uh, 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 worthy. Did not the angel say that Yahweh Shai was worthy yeah. in, in the spirit world? The lamb was worthy to uh, to loose the the, uh, the seals, yeah. and they gave him uh, uh, praises and, and, and honor yeah. and glory and, and blessings. Yeah. Okay. Now, somebody get Revelation 4. 4 and 11, right? Yep. Get Revelation 4, man. Because the, the 24 elders and the angels are up there, they're worshiping before Yahweh, but Yahweh Shah is, is right, right beside him. And he's sitting at his right hand. You know? And they're giving praise to them both. To him that sit on the throne and the lamp. <laughs> Revelation 4 and uh, what? Starting around like 10? Matter of fact, start at uh, start at 8. <laughs> Revelation 4 and 8. Read it out, bro. And the four beasts had each of them six wings about him. And they were they were full of eyes within. And they rest not day and night saying, Holy, holy, 
Lord God Almighty, uh -huh. which is, which and is, which and, was, which and was is. and is, and is to come. That's right, man. Who's the holy, holy, holy? God Almighty. Right. Go ahead. Verse nine. And when those beasts give glory and honor and thanks to him that sat on the throne, who liveth forever and ever, the four and twenty elders fell, fall down before him and sat on the throne and worship him that liveth forever and ever and cast their crowns before the throne, saying, yep. Thou art worthy, O Lord, to receive glory and honor and uh, power. Uh. For thou hast created all things and for thy pleasure they are all they were all created so this is the 24 created. elders in the heavens worshiping yahweh and yahweh shai man that's an example of them worshiping before them in the spirit realm man that's the only job and only they're job. doing that 20 they they doing that not 24, because that's, 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 that's a different time zone, you know, that's not our time zone, but they're doing it pretty much forever and ever, man. Okay, those 24 elders are worshiping before the throne of Yahweh to, uh, for, forever and ever, man. That's why they was created. They don't never stop. They were created just to do that, okay? And they're giving praise in, in the same worship to Yahweh Shah, because they, they mentioned the Lamb. And the Lamb was the one that created the heavens and the earth. Okay. Yeah. Revelations 5 and 11. Revelations 5 and 10. It has made us unto our God, kings and priests. And we shall reign on the earth. And I beheld, and I heard the voice of many angels round about the throne, and the beast and the elders. And the number of them was ten thousand times ten thousand, and thousands of thousands, saying with a loud voice, Worthy is the man that was slain to receive power, and riches, and wisdom, and strength, and honor, and glory, and blessing. And every creature which is in heaven and on earth and on the earth and under the sea and under the earth and on the earth and under the earth and such as are in the sea and all that are in them heard, a, heard I say blessing and honor and glory and power be unto him that sitteth upon the throne and unto the Lamb forever and ever and unto the Lamb Huh? Him the they're, giving is equal, they're giving equal worship. Right. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. But okay, you say we're greater than oh, the neighbors, oh. right? What? But but we ain't we can't do what they do. They doing the right thing. How much more we are supposed to glory in? The word worship from ed, from the edamonline.com. Worship. Old English, worship. The condition of being worthy, dignity, glory, distinction, honor, renown. Okay? Worthy, reverence paid to a supernatural or divine being. Okay? Worshipful is hey man, get your silly ass out of here, man. man. No, just keep on walking, man. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, man. Keep on walking, man. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We don't need no money or nothing. Keep on, man. Keep it moving. Punk ass motherfucker. Satan always got to make himself manifest when heavy edification is coming. All right? You're going to walk your ass right this way with all that room over there. Yeah, that was Satan. Yeah. He just got controlled by the spiritual demon Satan. You know I had to check myself. I was going to go get him right. <laughs> Yeah, man. That was Satan right there. I stepped out there, man. I stepped Yeah, Woo, Lord. Yeah, man. <laughs> but, um. Y'all don't know how heavy the spirit is now. The spirit is heavy. It ain't time to be playing no games, man. Over yeah. semantics, man. 
That's all y'all doing, playing games, trying to, trying to uh, oh, uproot yes. brothers that, that, that's trying to strengthen their foundation. Woo. Hey, so according to, according to Edom Online uh, Dictionary, or Edom Online, uh, the etymology uh, dictionary, worship basically means the condition of being worthy, all right, to be honorable. Yeah. Or not all those things that uh, uh, pertain to Yahweh Shai, as we read them in the scriptures. Yeah. Okay. We're honorable. But you say we're not supposed to worship. So we, we, it's not a question of, of, of Yahweh being worthy. That's not a question. But you're questioning if, if, if Yahweh Shai worthy of that honor and, and worship. Right. The answer is yes. Read that, 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 that was it on, on the definition. Right. Revelation 5 and 14. And the four beasts said, Amen. And the four and twenty elders fell down and worshiped him that liveth forever and ever. Uh-huh. That, that, that's talking about your house, but they already have worshiped your house also. With the with the Holy Father. Oh yeah, together, your house and your house. From verse 13. So all this separation that y'all trying to make it, we're not making it into a trinity, because that's what they said at first. Right. They tried to get the brother, oh, he worshiped your house while I see you outside. What are you talking about your house? But there's no trinity there's in, no, in, in that. Trinity means three, you right. jackass. Because that's what he was at the, the brothers in Chicago. For the brothers in Chicago, they say trinity, they said in the spirit, uh, uh, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, and the elect are all one in, in, in the spirit, man. Right. On the same accord, man. That's the righteous trinity. I'm saying, right, I'm saying when they tried to say, um, the traditional trinity. No, 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 when, 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 when Sakari and then they tried to say that when he, when he was talking about Yahweh, yeah. when he said Yahweh was shot, he oh, didn't right, make the right. separation. Right. Trying to make him like he's talking about the trinity, the brother was talking about the trinity. Right. Well, well, when we denounce that, you don't even see what you're doing, the type of demon you be. Yep. You're trying to make a division instead of clearing up what he said or just understanding what every other brother understood that has this information and this understanding. Yep. You went and tried to make some nitpick ass bitch ass shit, man. Yep. That's all you up here doing, man, doing some bitch ass movements, man. Straight up, and I stand by those words. You ain't doing nothing but stir up strife where it don't belong. Because you know that you ain't got that coming on this side. If you, if the attention you want, that's going to be your uh, your consolation. And guess what? Your 15 minutes of fame with uh, Polite and Sarnetta, that's all. That's all. Sarnetta don't want to deal with you because you ain't got nothing about what to say. Can't make no money for him. Can't make no money for him. <laughs> you want no friend. Get Revelation 14 and 7. Revelation 14 and 7. Revelation 14 and 7. Saying with a loud voice, Fear ye Howard and give glory to him. For the hour of his judgment is come. And worship him that made heaven and earth wait, and wait. the sea. Who, who did that? Huh. Who, who did that? Yeah, who created you the heavens and the, the, the earth? First off, where did you get the breakdown of who did that? Right? right? From the apostles, right? So. Because I know you got that breakdown, who is that? Who created the heavens and the earth? We all know the answer to that. That had that breakdown. Uh, so now that's John the first chapter, right? Yeah. Grab that right quick. Then we're gonna also, read that again. Colossians, uh, Colossians, the Colossians, first chapter. Tell us what you want. Well, which one you want? So, somebody could get John uh, one and one. John 1 and 1. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with Yahweh. The Word was with Yahweh. Okay. Go ahead. And the Word was Yahweh. No, the, no. Now, I'm going to correct that. that. That's not. What that's saying is the Word was power, not the Most High. The Mo, Yahweh Shah, he's the Word. He's not Yahweh. But he was with Yahweh in the beginning. Yeah. Right. That's how you break that down. Okay. So when it says, and the word is, God is really saying, and the word is the power. Okay? The word was power. Okay? The word was power. And the word was power. Okay, Yahweh Shah, he is power, man. Okay. 
He's the power that created all powers on the earth. So I was going to say, there's the most high power who has this most supreme power, and the lesser power of Yahweh Son for him, and all the way down to us men that are, have a, a lesser power than they yep. on this earth also. That's right, man. Proverbs 30 and 4. No? No, no. Go ahead. Verse 2. The same was in the beginning with Yahweh. Yep. All things were made of him, and without him was not anything made that was made. See that? Yep. So everything that's created was by the word, man. Okay? The elements, everything that you see before you was created by who you ignorantly call Jesus Christ. But your pastor would ignorantly tell you that it was actually the Heavenly Father himself. Right. So the Heavenly Father sat on his throne and gave his son the blueprint to put all this together, man. Right. He gave him the ingredients and he went, he told him, this is what you, these are the ingredients <laughs> and this is how you put it together. I'm not gonna put it together for you. I'm gonna show you how to do it, but you're gonna be the one to do it. And once you create it, it's gonna be for you. It's gonna be yep. yours. Yep. Okay? That's just like a father, he, um, he creates a toy, right? Let's say he creates a race car track for his, his son. He, 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 he made the pieces, all right? He, he, he got all of the pieces, but it wasn't put together yet. But he, he, he gives his son the instructions on how to put it together. Once, he, once his son put that together, then his father would be like, all right, you complete. Well, well done, son. Now go on and play with that. That's all yours. Are right, you the owner of that? You own that. That's for you. Okay? The same thing. Yeah, was that it? Uh, and, and, and John? Yeah, you wanted that part right there. That was made. That was made. And him, life, and life. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's it. Go ahead. Okay, um, this is Colossians chapter. Um, one, I'm going to start at 14. No, no, no. Start at 12. It says, Giving thanks unto the Father, which has made us meet to a part to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light, uh -huh. who have delivered us from the power of darkness and have translated us into the kingdom of his dear son. Yep. Well, it's his toy, right? Or his book, right? It says, in whom we have redemption through his blood, even the forgiveness of sins, yep. who is the image of the invisible Yahweh, Yep. Power Yahweh said the first. Because he did because what did Yahweh Shah tell um, Philip? Yep. If you've seen me, you've seen the Father. Right. Okay? Because he looked exactly, he's a split image of, of his father, man. Yep. Okay. He says, um, who, uh, the firstborn of every creature. The firstborn of every creature, man. He was the first spirit created. Okay? And that same spirit in turn created the rest of the spirits, man. Huh. Go ahead. It says, for by him were all things created. So by who the world and the color of Jesus Christ, all things were made. Okay? Every all, Everything out here was, was made by him. Okay? And you're going to tell me we're not supposed to worship him? Go ahead, huh? It says, um, for, for by him were all things created uh -huh. that are in heaven, that, so that's talking about the, 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 the galaxy, all right, the different planets, the stars, the moon, the sun, okay? The earth, to be clear, we ain't separated. Because you stupid niggas didn't pick on words, man. I'm talking about everything in the heavens as well as the right. earth, which is going to say. Right? It says, that are in heaven and that are in earth. The angels, okay? What's in the earth? The animals? You plants, people, plants. All right. Concrete, dirt, everything. Go ahead. It says uh, visible and invisible. So that's even talking about spirits, because you can't see spirits, but they, but they here. Can't see the air. Either. You can't see the air that you breathe, but it, but it's there. The wind that blows. Okay. The different principalities. All right. The Lord, Yahweh Shah created all of those things, man. He created demons, he created angels. 
Go ahead and their purposes. That's right. It says uh, whether they be thrones or dominions or principalities or powers, all things were created by him and for him. They were all created by him and for him. All right. And he is before all things, and by him all things consist. And by him all things consist. Okay. And he is the head of the body, the church, who is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead, that in all things he might have the preeminence. Yep, the, pre the, the preeminence is talking about his superiority, man. His supreme being. All right? A man that's responsible for creating the, the very same planet that you walk on is, deser is deserving of praise and worship. Yeah. Okay. It says, it says, For it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. <laughs> and having made peace through the blood of his cross, by him to reconcile all things unto himself. Hmm. By him, we get back to Yahweh, by Yahweh Shai, right? by him, I say whether they be things in earth or things in heaven. Hey, and guess what? All these things that we're speaking of, that credit still goes to Yahweh, man. Yep. We're still giving all this credit and praise and glory to Yahweh, man. Because it's all going through Yahweh Shah. Okay? I mean, it's starting to become repetitive, and but annoying. that's because the Spirit wants it to be, man. It, it, he really want it so it can marinate with the, the, the men of the Lord who are, who are destined to get this, man. All right, the elect. All right, but as long as it's uh, 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 um, being repetitive, it ain't gonna go through to the, the stubborn and rebellious, man. You're not, you're not hearing what the word gotta say, man. You're going by your.